to a new video. We're out here today at the Sprinker Recreational Center at the skate park here in Spanaway. There's a lot to the skate park, but I mostly just skate the bottom curb with the coping on it and the ledge that's right next to me. If you're subscribed to the video and you've watched my skate videos or skate footage, I have a whole part basically in this skate park last summer. I think it was last summer or the summer before. I don't know. I put out a whole part just with skate park footage, no street footage involved. I've never done that before, a long time ago. And that's what I did. So go down there and check it out. That's what I'm trying to tell you after you watch this video. But we're here gonna skate this one, get warmed up on the curb, and see where the skateboard takes us. I forgot how to back 50. Here's a problem. It's not really a problem. I just don't skate skate parks no more, and I'm the only one in here. And back in the day, I used to be good at back 50s and back 50s on this ledge. Because I used to work here. So I don't know how long ago it was. Like five, maybe two, 2006, 2007. I don't know how many years ago that was, but I used to work here and just skate. That was my job was to skate around the park and make sure nobody was doing what they weren't supposed to be doing. You know, so I skate here every day. So it was like basically, this was my home park. I was a local and I got paid to skate here. That was cool, but it lasted like, I don't know how long it lasted. I worked here for a while, maybe a season from like May. Yeah, like May, a whole summer to like November. I skated here, I got paid for it. I had to wear a shirt that said Sprinkler Recreational Center on it. So back 50s and back 50s and when I used to be good at backside tricks, I used to do those tricks every day. Now it's like I skate curbs on the streets and it's different because a curb on a street, it's a curb, it's concrete. So you're used to fucking smashing as fast as you can to ollie up and grind it. This is like smooth ground and metal coping and just gotta get my skate legs back like I was saying for the skate park. I got one, one backside 50-50. I guess that's good. Whatever. I skate different now. I don't skate like I used to back in the day. I got a completely different trick selection and stuff. So like backside tricks are different. Like I can't, I got one feeble slash back 50, call it good. You know what it is with the backside tricks for some reason today, it's because I want to do them and I'm trying to force myself to do it and it's not working. So never try to force yourself to do something that you know, you don't want to, like, you want to do it, but you just don't want to force your body into, like, doing something that it doesn't want to do. I got to get used to all in, over and up. Because that's how I back, back, do backside tricks. I ollie up and over the obstacle. I don't ollie and turn my body into it. I ollie over it. So, I almost ate shit on one really bad. And I'm just going to go do different tricks. What the fuck? Spooky! Fix your fucking brain! Shit! I've been to rougher ass street spots that are fucking smoother than this ground right here. Holy shit. There, that's good. That's good enough. Holy cow. Sprinkler, with all the money you get from the ice skating rink, from the tennis court, 
from, you know, I don't know where you get your money from, but I know you have enough to fix the landing uh, where the bank is at because you fixed the landing where the stairs are at, so why can't you do it where the bank is at? It's not that hard to go pour some uh, concrete. I remodeled my house and I built it from the ground up. I put every single screw in every single wall in my house. So if you need help pouring concrete, I could help you because it's not that hard to pour some concrete. Fucking Dawn! I'm about to fucking cry. Holy shit. Fully fucking custom joints. Hello. Hello. Fully custom. Fully customizable. Here we go. For the custom joints. Twenty thousand tries later, I'm never coming here again. Like it's a cool place, but it's like the vibe of it. Even like just by yourself, the vibe is fucking snooty as fuck here. Snooton, we're here at Snooton Skate Park. That's what they should call it, the Snooton Skate Park. I built better shit than this outside my house. Let's go skate. In my grandpa's driveway. Built way sicker shit than here. I'm a street skater, not a skate park skater. I've completely converted. I'm about to be 34 years old. I don't have time playing games. I'm trying to try a fakey pop shove it. I'm trying to fakey 50 50 switch pop shove it out for, you know, an hour. You know, too long. It's too much. I'd rather go to the streets, go film my shit, come back, make ill videos. You know, even though I'm the only one here, just the vibe of this place is not cool anymore. I've had, you know, it was fun at one time, but now it's not cool. The people, some people are cool that come here, some people just give this place a bad name. So, let's go get into a better vibe. Why are you like this? <laughs>